Well, fears are still fresh just two weeks after the massacre of 17 innocent lives. And tonight, a new surge of people signing up to pack heat. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith joins us live with the reason why. Ryan? Gun experts tell me, Wendy, that it's a common trend seen after any active shooter tragedy, just like the one we saw in Parkland two weeks ago. A dramatic surge to buy and train at places like this Brandon gun range. Lock and load it. People are rushing to get a concealed carry permit, and it's been nonstop ever since the shooting occurred. Ryan Thomas typically teaches five concealed carry classes per week, but now high demand is pushing his company, Tampa Carry, to expand up to nine classes a week. We never know when a bad guy is going to kick in your door and try to hurt your family, and you have to be ready for those moments. Heather Conkey completed her concealed carry training tonight. With the Parkland incident, a push for me to go ahead and get this taken care of. The mother of three will apply for a gun permit first thing tomorrow. The more of us that are responsible, educated, and have a concealed weapons permit, the better off we are as a society. And she's not alone. Thomas says since the tragedy in South Florida, a steady stream of teachers and concerned parents are signing up for his class. Teachers want the option to be able to do something if a bad guy approaches and is trying to hurt them or hurt their children. And get this, we did some checking here tonight and at the Tampa gun show that happened last week in just nine days after that Parkland shooting, well, they saw record attendance with 13,000 people visiting the gun show. Live tonight in Brandon, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.